Welcome to the second Atom CLI tutorial using PuTTY. This session is targeted for Windows users who want access to the command line for their Vagrant box. We're assuming that you've already watched tutorial one and installed our Vagrant box. Get it booted up. You should also have PuTTY already installed. At this point, we're going to launch PuTTY. When you first launch PuTTY, you'll see a configuration page. We'll enter for the host name our IP address for our Vagrant box, 10.10.10.10. .10 you can leave the port as 22. If we give this session a name down below, we can save it and reuse it again. Before we proceed, we we'll want to make sure that we have all the settings correctly configured. In the sidebar, select the translation option and make sure that your language encoding is set to UTF-8. Once we've selected this, click on the session tab again and be sure to click save so your options are saved. Now we can launch our session. Putty will open a command line interface. You'll be prompted to log in. The default login both username and password for our Vagrant box is Vagrant. And we're ready to go. If we do a simple ls command, we can see that both Atom and the Atom docs are included in the 2.3 Vagrant box. We're now ready to start using the command line tools available in Atom. Check out the further tutorials to see some of these in action.